Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank each and every one of y'all for clicking on today's video. We're so grateful that you choose to click on this video and be a part of our family, our farm, and just being here with us. Be sure to leave a, a comment down below, even if it's a thumbs up or a heart. Well, last night we had a huge issue. Um, it, it was so crazy. We woke up, the coyotes were actually on the hill up there and uh, they come back through there was six of them um, and i'll tell you a little bit how i know that here in just a second let me open this gate so these goats can get in here but um yeah i i, I don't know uh, what else to do i do know that layton's going to be getting his traps out um, He's going to be getting his trap set today. We're going to actually move some stuff around to move our, our deer blind around so we can... Um, yeah, they got out. I left that other gate open. Um, so we can set it up on a hill so we can look down to see where the, the goats and stuff are. Um, I, I did get a little bit of footage when I come out of how close they were. I actually sat in front of the car there and uh, up there on the hills where they come up there by that brown building and I had a perfect perfect I had a perfect perfect money money shot and before I started to pull the trigger I thought that is going that's a hill and I'm shooting up here's the deal that it's got to land if it's, if it's going up it's got to come down there's a bunch of houses and stuff over there, so I decided not to take it. And um, I think what I'm gonna do is take our deer blind. I'm gonna move it up here on the hill, but I'm gonna point it down this way to try to get these guys. I don't know what else to do. They have taunted us. They've, I don't know, it's crazy. But we got a lot of things to do. Um, Kaysen's got, got some, uh, some babies. I don't know if I've already showed y'all yet. But uh, we're going to be moving them and uh, showing you how many he's got. And uh, we got a lot of things going on. We may not finish it all up today, but if not, it'll be in the next video. Like I say, guys, we just film our everyday life. And, you know, just depends on where the video ends or, you know, what we're doing ends. The video may be 25 minutes and maybe 40 minutes. So. Anyways, I'm gonna go in here and get Kaysen and uh, we're gonna get this day started. Yeah, literally, the, the coyotes were standing right there. And I should have took it, but I just didn't want to take that chance. But uh, you can hear how loud they was. I'll play that footage for you. All right, guys. Dogs are going crazy. The coyotes are back here. They're right here. Well, good morning, guys. Thank each and every one of y'all for joining us today. Well, we got the whole crew here. We are going to actually start working the goats today. Hopefully, we can get through all of them. I think we'll be able to. But um, the main thing we're going to do is we're going to worm them, vaccine them. We're going to clip their toenails and uh, check for pink eye. And we do have a, a few little sick goats, so they're gonna be getting some shots and some ear tags. And so all of us has got a position here, and that's what I was telling kids. Everybody's got a position, and each position is really, really important. So we're going to run them up here, turn them over, we'll clip them, and um, kind of go from there. Now guys, for the people that do have done this before, just bear with us. This is our first time, and I'm sure. Um, There'll we, be some mess ups. Yeah, there will be some mess ups, but um, we're going to document everything through our GOAT app with the ear tags, the medication, and uh, we'll check the ear tags if we need to. We'll cut the ear tag, put a new ear tag in, and just kind of go from there. So I hope y'all enjoy today's video. 
Um, like I said, is we're probably we're not going to make y'all watch all of this all the way through. So there'll be different parts of other stuff throughout the day. So stay tuned because I'm going to show you some footage of me and Layton going trying to take care of the um, coyotes last night. All right, so. We're gonna go get these goats and try to get them in here, get them pinned up, and we'll start running through them, so. All right, guys, let's go up here and get them and bring them in here and get it started. I'm gonna go get the All right, go ahead and go up to the back side. Are we gonna do use feed to get them in? Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Shut that gate. Shut that gate. Come on, girls. Hip, 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 hip. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Hip, 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 hip. Gate. Okay. Oh. Go ahead. Push. You said get ready. You didn't say to do it. <laughs> Go. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're super excited, but this is going to be a little, a little test. So we'll see what happens. Um, see if, if you want to get right over here at the end. Of the um, don't forget the feeds right there. Do you want to go ahead and dump it out for the ghosts no. that come in, or? So I've had this tied so they can hit that and run. So now, so now, go ahead and tighten it up. Yeah. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Go. It's good. Yeah, that'll work. All right, Layton, open it. Make sure it's still zero. Yeah, we're good. That one in? Just one this time. Come on. Oh, he's too scared. Oh, here's, here's one. Yep. Got some uh, wormer here, and then we got the vaccine. We got to leave this cool. Um, but you're doing good. I got a shot in my foot, um, foot when I was doing my surgery. Really? Yeah. Come on, girl. Come on. Go, 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 go. Go. Hip, hip, hip. All right, so we're going to squeeze it. All right, we're going to clip it. Watch it, girl. Camera here, so you may have to come back here. Okay. So we've needed to to do their toenails for a good while now, and this is the reason why. But now we got the the tools to do it. So we're gonna. Come on, girls. 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 See how this is, and yes, we've. This is our fault. 
but we've, you know, like I said, we haven't been able to get something like this, but you know, with many goats we got, it take quite a bit for somebody to come and do all of them. But you see that. Cause I watched the video um, and um, so they had a pony, but not a goat. Oh yeah. And um, there was pain in his foot. And then they just had to trim their nails off. Yeah, that's what we're doing. All right, guys. All right, guys. That was a scary moment for uh, Moon Spot. I will say that that was all my fault. I don't, I don't know what I was thinking, but earlier we ran some through, and it wasn't tight enough, and they come out of the top. So I'm having to learn how to do this. Yes, I've almost killed one of our goats, but. Um, I'm gonna try to help her make sure she's good. I monitor her and we will just kind of keep an eye on her. Like I said, guys, this is my fault, but Pray to God she recovers. She's already a lot better than what she was. Um, now I've got to figure a way how tight to actually adjust them. So, orange should be in it. Seventy pounds. Gonna be a good size. It's gonna take a little longer to get these, you know, the first go around. We'll do it more often. And uh, it won't be so bad. She never was the first one that didn't require any help. But then stop. I see what people was talking about now. And it makes sense. Because we don't have all the rocks and stuff down here like a lot of other people. Are you not doing shots today?
Thought you do it under the neck. She was the one that had it bad last year. She had pink eye bad last year. So you say it's got that poop in there, you want to clean it off. And this is something you can learn like me as I go. So, you know, one day we all will just get out here and have clippers. Yeah. See how that is, you can't see nothing really. So you yeah. come back here, you don't want to cut too deep from what I've learned. Yeah, he can. Same deal here. It's just kind of like toenails, looks like. But a lot longer. Yeah, but I'm I'll, I'm cleaning these out so I can see how deep they go, cause like that in there. Like some of them might have never been clipped before. See how that toe was cut back like that? Yeah. Each one of them is going to be different. I need to, somebody to go get some ice out of the freezer. Go get some ice. Yeah, go get some ice. Oh, uh, what free? Like the, this? the red, the white one. Okay. Oh, that's how you go. Oh, okay. Go. Do what, son? Juice. Here. That's your chair. All right, run her up here, son. Yeah, I already wrote it down. Are you going to use the rest of this on her or you need to fill it up more? No, just give her that. Okay. If I get blood in it, I have to pull it out. Because that means you're in a vein. Come on, finish it. Down there, get her eyes. Yeah. All right, guys, it's starting to get really, really hot uh, for the goats as well. Being in there, it got hot for us as well. Um, man, it's not as easy as what it looks like. I think we ended up getting through about 12 or 13 of them. Um, Tomorrow or the next day, we'll get up early. We'll start working a few. It's just going to take a little bit of time getting the routine. But um, 
we're going to take a break for a little bit before we have to get back on some other chores going on and then i'm going to take you up there and show you um, where we actually moved the deer blind so we can start getting rid of the coyotes man we're under attack here like i say they was i mean right here at the house I, they're not scared but we're gonna have to put a stop to it all right guys so i didn't make it up here to show y'all yesterday um what we did with the deer blind but um come up here today i tell you this weather is hot code hot code is wearing me out um right here is where we ended up moving the uh deer blind and uh, i said it earlier in the video i had a really good shot on them and i did not want to take it because it was shooting up into the air um, obviously if a, something goes up it's got to go down so we ended up moving this here and the um, reason why I put it right here and face them where I am right now is because over in here, this area, this is where they have been coming in and I got an embankment and, sh and actually the object will be going down and not up. So um, I don't know. This is, this is the worst it's ever been here. Um, with the the guineas um they're, they're just taking them left and right um, i'm going to go put up a scarecrow tonight i'm going to put up some flags i'm going to do whatever i have to 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 get them to go away i actually think it's an owl that's taking the guineas but also like the was that an owl Is that? No, it's not an owl. It's one of these birds. Huh. It's at the very top of the tree there. That's pretty neat. Which guys, <clears throat> they have no problem with the guineas during the day. That's, that's, the, that's the crazy thing. Look, that's them right now. I mean, they, they, the yard, everything. They go anywhere. Stephanie actually showed me a spot where we got some guinea eggs. Um, they found some guinea eggs and we're going to be gathering them because I don't want to take a chance of any of the, the guineas actually um, anything taking the eggs. I know that um, I enjoy raising these chickens. I enjoy them. It's therapeutic. It's good for kid, uh, Kaysen and other kids. And we're going to continue doing it. But we got to figure out how to get this under control. And um, I'm going to try some things. It might not look good around here with these things up in the air, but at least it'll put a stop to them. So I told y'all that Steph found some eggs. I know everyone don't watch both channels, so, and sometimes you can't watch both of the videos, but I'm gonna show you where she found them real quick. She found them right there. Oh, which there's three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12. There's 13 eggs there. Zoom in there. I think that's right. Four, eight, 12, 13. There's 13 eggs there. She found those eggs and um, I'm gonna probably trade those eggs out with some of the bad ones we got. I'm going to mark. Um, I got to thinking about that because if we don't, something to end up getting them. So, but, um, also, like I said yesterday, the goat that we had to shoot squeeze too tight, that's my fault. Um, I debated whether or not to put that in there, but um, after thinking about it, maybe somebody that purchases this equipment sees what happens and it will save them from actually losing uh, a goat or something. So we put everything in our videos, everything's real life. 
we want you all to be a huge part of our farm and um, that's what we share the good and the bad but man life don't get much better than this turn around here and look this is absolutely awesome there's cowboy jerry there's two of the girls another one of the turkeys and then looky over there there's all the goats that's just absolutely amazing amazing stuff right there don't get much better than that but um thank y'all so much for watching our videos and showing y'all's love and support to our channel we greatly appreciate it if you're new to the channel be sure to like and subscribe hope you have a wonderful day god bless